Hey, what's up YouTube? It's Tony, and today I wanted to let everyone know that we may have our first look as to where Apple's 2019 Worldwide Developer Conference, referred to as WWDC for short, is going to take place and when. This and more in today's video. So before we get too far in this video, like, comment, and subscribe for future Apple and jailbreaking updates. Okay, let's get into the news. This year's 2019 Worldwide Developer Conference, according to Mac Rumors, is going to take place on the first week of June, from June 3rd to the 7th at the McHenry Convention Center in San Jose, California. And if history repeats itself, the main keynote presentation is likely to take place on Monday the 3rd at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time or 1 p.m. Eastern. Now, at this event, Apple is expected to unveil and showcase this year's major iOS update, presumably called iOS 13. Now, we haven't talked much about the rumors, but it's anticipated that iOS 13 will include some new major features, a major design overhaul for all iOS devices. A native dark mode feature may finally see its way to iPhones, new file system management for iPads, and an all-new redesigned home screen for both are three of the new major features worth noting. Now along with this, we can expect other major OS updates to their Macintosh, Apple Watch, and Apple TV lineups as well. Apple will be showcasing and demonstrating all of this live during the conference, and once the event concludes, Apple will be releasing the first beta iterations of their new software to registered developers. Now, this event in particular is focused around software, so I wouldn't hold your breath on any new hardware being released. But as we've seen in the past, Apple is likely to tease new projects that they have been working on introducing them with the now well-known phrase, oh, and one more thing. Apple is likely to be saving new hardware releases for the 2019 iPhone event this spring. Products like AirPower, AirPods, and the new iPad minis are just a few examples as to what could be released alongside the new flagship iPhones. Alternatively, Apple may hold a separate event as early as March or as late as October to release these new products. Now, iOS 13, macOS 10.15, and the 2019 conference are still months away, and the reported dates today were discovered through the grapevine and have yet to be officially confirmed by Apple. Apple will be sending official invites out sometime in March, so we'll know more concrete details then. Anyway, if you don't want to miss out on any of these exciting developments, definitely subscribe to stay updated with the latest Apple news. Let us know down below if you're excited for iOS 13 and what your number one feature request would be of this new software. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, definitely let me know with a huge thumbs up. But until next time, this is Tony, signing out.